Hello viewers, after introduction, I shall discuss how technometric ratios can be used. Previously, we studied about what are the so ka toha, so, soh, so ka toha, sin cos tan, or in old terminology, Pakistan, Bukha Pyasa, Hindustan, Harabara. This stands for sin, this for cos, this for tan, or in new terms, so ka toha. Now, we will solve first problem of exercise at point 1. In triangle ABC, right angled at B. Clear? This is right angle, 90 degree. If this is right angle, then obvious, this is what? Hypotenuse. Clear? AB is 24. Clear? If I consider this is like A, B, C. Given A, B, 24 meter BC 7 centimeter clear sorry AC is 24 centimeter this is 7 centimeter determine sine of A cosine of A sine of C cosine of C okay now in triangle we know that by Pythagoras theorem okay Pythagoras is very well known. Pythagoras theorem. AC square, hypotenuse square is leg first square plus leg second square. So leg first is 24 square plus 7 square. Square of 24, if you multiply 24 by 24, you will get 576 plus 49. If you sum these, then we get 625. This is square of 25. Clear? So now we come to that. Notice AC is what? 25 centimeter. Clear? So this is 25 centimeter. Now we go to first part. In first part, we have to find sine of A and cosine of A. Clear? Now we move to second part. Sine of A. What is sine of A? S O H so. Sine means opposite upon hypotenuse. Where is A? This is A. Clear? Now if we consider this as a theta, this is angle. A. What is opposite? Opposite is B C. Clear? Hypotenuse remains same, whatever with angle. So either A or either C. Hypotenuse will be remain always A C. So BC is what 7 and AC. AC is what 25. So this is value of a sine A. Now cosine of A. Clear? Sine of A. Now cosine of A. Cosine of A is what? Cos. So cos is. What is cos? This is opposite upon hypotenuse. This is adjacent. What is adjacent? Adjacent is AB. AB upon hypotenuse remains the same, no change in hypotenuse. AB, AB is what? 24 upon 25. Now we move to second part. Sine C and cosine C. Sine of C and cosine of C. Now what sine? Now this is very important. Angle will be changed. Now angle from this acute angle is A. Now acute angle is C. So if C is your acute angle. Now this, then this side is opposite side. Clear? This is your opposite. Or for theta, opposite side is this. Clear? This is opposite. Keep in mind. That might may be some problem. So in opposite side. So what is opposite side? Sine is what? So S O H sine opposite hypotenuse. So opposite is what? A B upon hypotenuse hypotenuse what ac now ab is what 24 ac is what 25 cosine of c cos it means cos means this is c cos adjacent bc upon ac what is bc bc is 7 ac is what 25 clear 
So these are answers of first and second part. I hope this will be clear to you. Now we move to second question of exercise 8.1. In figure 8.13, this is figure 8.13. This is 90 degree right angle given. Obvious right angle. It means this is what? Hypotense. Side opposite to right angle is known as a hypotense. Find tangent of P minus cot of R. Clear? We know. So, ka to. Clear? Hypotense opposite adjacent. Now, again, for going to solution, we have to find QR clear for QR so again we know that by Pythagoras theorem hypotenuse square is equals to leg first square plus leg second square clear this is well known Pythagoras theorem now therefore 12 square plus q where square is equals to 13 square now transfer qr square on transposition 13 square minus 12 square by using the identity a square minus b square a plus b and a minus b 13 plus 12 into 13 minus 12 that is 25 into 1 so now qr square is 5 square therefore qr equals to 5 centimeter or if you know then 5 12 13 are pythagorean triplet therefore this is 5 now what is our target 10 p clear 10 of p this is our, our target 10 p and cot of r clear 10 of p if this is angle p clear this is angle p then that is side what this side is what this is opposite side clear so what is to opposite upon adjacent so what is 10 for 10 p opposite side is what 5 and adjacent is what 12 clear this is angle P again see this is angle P so for this this is opposite side opposite side is what 5 and what is adjacent adjacent is what 12 clear now cot of R now acute angle will be changed this is angle R clear this is angle R now this side will be opposite side clear the opposite side will be what PQ if I see opposite side is what PQ sorry we have to find what cot cot is what opposite to 10 that is adjacent upon opposite what is adjacent adjacent is not PQ clear adjacent is QR QR upon PQ clear this is given cot cot is reciprocal to we know that cot of A is reciprocal to tan of a clear so that is qr upon pq what is qr 5 upon 12 now what is our question 10 p we have to find tangent of p minus cot of r both are same 5 by 12 minus 5 by 2 this is for 0 is our required answer i hope it will be clear. this will be clear to you now move to next question question number third given again similar problem an easiest problem sin a is 3 upon 4 calculate cos and tan a now we know so ka toa clear we know very well our side opposite right angle is 9 hypotenuse we can write anywhere a i write here a here b here c given sine of a is equals to 3 upon 3 upon 4 means this is ratio so we can write 3k upon 4k clear 3k upon 4k so 3k is what opposite side 
so ka so s o h so the sign this is opposite or this is hypotenuse clear sine of is 3.4 opposite opposite side if this is angle a now this is opposite side 3k this is hypotenuse 4k clear now this is right angle b clear cos antenna so if 3k is 4k then we have to again find what b a so similar way to earlier questions b square by using pythagoras theorem 4k square minus 3k square that is 16k square minus 9k square that is 7k square it means what is the value of b a b a will give to be root 7k with positive since side cannot be negative so b a is what root 7k clear now what we have to find cos a and tan a clear so now cos a clear second one cos cos a is what adjacent now adjacent a b upon hypotenuse c a or b upon h whatever your terminology used so a b a b is what a b is root 7k upon a c a c is what 4k k and k cancel out so therefore root 7 upon 4 now next one is tan of a tan of a is what tan of a toa okay opposite 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 is what bc upon adjacent ac or ca doesn't matter so bc is 3k and ac is 4k clear 3 upon 4 so 3 upon 4 so tangent of a is 3 upon 4 clear so now bc 3 or sorry sorry tangent of a is bc upon opposite upon adjacent adjacent is what ab clear 3k upon ab is what root 7k clear root 7k so this is what 3 upon root 7 clear this is 3 upon root 7 now this is third question now move to fourth question okay similarly given cot of a 15 cot of a is 8 it means what solution cot of a cot of a is what 8 upon 15 cot of a is reciprocal to this therefore this is adjacent upon this is opposite so if i write this as a this is b this is c now b is right angle 90 degree obvious this is hypotenuse this is a this is our theta angle acute angle theta the so cot of a the so adjacent adjacent is what 8 k this is what 15 k clear the so cot of a is 8 upon 15 so now this is what adjacent again we have to write 8k upon 15k because these are the ratio now find by pythagoras theorem again ac square is equals to 8k square whole square plus 15k whole square that is 64k square plus square of 15 is 225k square clear so 5 per 4 9 6 to 8 289 k square ac square equals to this gives to ac is equals to 17 k square of 17 is 289 therefore ac is 17 k so now this hypotenuse is what 17 k 
clear what we have to find we have to find sine of a and secant of a or sec a. clear now this is a sine f a so opposite upon hypotenuse so for this a this side is this is known as opposite the opposite side is what bc upon hypotenuse always remains same bc upon ac so bc 15k upon 17k that is 15 upon 17 now sec sec is reciprocal to cos therefore now hypotenuse cos is what hypotenuse reciprocal of cos therefore hypotenuse upon adjacent the hypotenuse is what ac adjacent is what ab the ratio of ac upon ab ac is what 17k upon 8k k and k cancel out therefore 17 these are our answers i hope this will be clear to you if you feel useful then like share and subscribe my channel thank you for watching